thought that this would work. I thought it would get us out of trouble. I know, I know. Don't worry about it. What are you doing? What does it look like? I'm stealing your car. What? I'm jacking the SUV. I mean stealing. I know what it means, but you can't. I'm out of options, Star. I'll chop this and I'll get the cash to bowl. I thought you wanted to stop stealing cars. I want us to both keep breathing. Look, if I don't get that money back that I took... Okay, we could find it. I mean, we could go try to look for... Forget it! That money is long gone. Wait, okay. There has to be another way. $50,000 in the next two hours? How's that going to happen? Well, my dad will be here soon. You do not want to get him involved. Okay, but then you won't be around. Look, listen. My dad will buy me the car. He'll give me the keys. I'll give the keys to you. It'll be legal. What if he gets in the middle of things? He put in. Okay, he will, but I'll handle him when he does. What if he makes you go home with him? Bull's following me and you. That would lead him straight to your family, to your daughter. There has to be some other way. Look, I've done this a thousand times. That's not comforting, James. Multiple felonies does not make me feel better about this. Okay, look, I don't want to add anything else to my rap sheet either, but... You're right. Wait, what? What, what, what just happened? You're right. I mean, I'm not the only one. If I steal this car, you're an accomplice. And I can't do that to you, so just forget it. Well, and then what? I don't know. Maybe I'll turn myself in. You'll go to jail? Well, at least there my dad can't touch me. Probably. Steal it. What? Come on. Jack my car. A new side of you, Twinkle. I like it. Just get the keys and let's go. I need to get back to my family. I thought you were a pro. At hot wiring, not picking locks. Well, how did you get into the car in the first place? You don't pick a car lock. This. Would you just let me do this? And then we'll get out of here. Well, I can't exactly just drive off with that guy there. I need a diversion. Okay, I'll handle it. Just get the keys. Just get the keys? And do it quickly, or else we are both going to jail. I'm sorry, Miss Manning. My supervisor is finishing with another customer. He'll be with you shortly. Uh, it's no problem. We'll just wait here. Have a seat. Uh, we don't, we don't need any company. My supervisor wants to make sure he sees all the paperwork. Actually, my friend here wants to look at that sports car that we were checking out earlier. You want to see the 920? Why not? Right this way. Sure. Thank you, God. Oh, what's your problem? Nothing. I'm still alive. Oh, please. Come on. I had to put some distance between us and the car dealer. Yeah, who was not in hot pursuit with a loaded gun. Did you notice that part? Nobody was shooting at no, I'm not going to take any chances. Um, you took a corner at 50 on two wheels, and you cut off an armor truck on an exit ramp. Are we here? Those are big chances. Are we here safe and sound? Look, first rule of car theft if is... If you don't talk about car theft... No. Blend into traffic. Don't draw attention to yourself. We are here safe and sound, right? You have a car that you can use to pay off full. In theory. What? When you're the master carjacker here, so what happens now? I have no idea. Why don't you know what happens next? This is a new situation. How many cars have you stolen? That was back home, okay? I've got to figure this out. Okay, so you take a car and you cut it up. Chop. You chop the car. Okay, you chop the car and then you sell the pieces, right? Right. Okay. So do you know anyone who fences stolen goods in Landview? Not offhand. Okay. Well, if we were in Ohio, well, we're I know who to call. We're not in Ohio, and we can't go to Ohio. I know. That's why I have to figure this out here, okay? I've got to find a contact now. How long is that going to take? I don't know. That's not good enough. This needs to be over now. I did not steal a car for this not to be over now. I 
get it. All right, I get it. Do you? Yes. You want this over now. And there's only one option. What's that? I call Bull. You want to call the guy we've been hiding from? The guy who wants to break your kneecaps for stealing $50,000? They owed me that money. This is insane. Not totally, okay? I know that Bull might want to hurt me, okay? But we've got a car that's worth more than what I owe him. We could just give Bull the car. And what if he doesn't want it? He could take it and sell the parts just like I would. Well, does he know the right guys that he can sell the parts to? He doesn't need to. Bull's not on the run, okay? He can he can make the contacts. He can take it out of state and sell it if he wanted to. What if he takes the car and still comes after you? But why? He knows I don't have the money. Look, he's just an employee star. He's only doing what my dad wants. So you really think that we could trust him? It's the only choice we've got. Good news. I've got your money. No kidding, I thought you lost it. It turned up. Lucky you. So, just to be clear, I give you the money today and we're clear, right? If that's how it goes, sure. That's how it'll go. I'm sorry it's been so much trouble. It's okay. We all make mistakes. 